Hello, people for Democratic Party reform. This is your truly Nina Turner. I want you to know I'm pausing. I am out canvassing. Many of you may know that I am running for Congress in Ohio 11th District, but I stopped so that I could record this video because I could not be with you in real time. I want to thank you so much for all the work that you do to reform the Democratic Party and make it a party that welcomes all people. A party that understands that what we are fighting for, what we should be standing for, is really rooted in a value system that lifts all people. For your organization, your fight to make sure that the party is welcoming and also that the party is doing the right thing by the people, it takes immense courage and commitment to be able to do what you are doing. So I salute you that you are not going along to get along, that you are analyzing situations, that you are holding the Democratic Party's feet to the fire, making sure that it adheres to its rules and making sure that it continues to be a big tent party as it purports to be. Your group, along with some other groups out there, are actually doing the work to be the change within the Democratic Party. And I'm telling you, I absolutely salute you and I know so many others do because your work and your commitment to making the Democratic Party better and making it stronger and making it answer to the will of the people will ultimately help the Democratic Party. And there are some people I know who do not see it that way, but thank you for your courage. You know, as we were just reflecting on Congressman John Lewis and all the great work that he has done, we all know that he talked a lot about making good trouble. And that is in fact what your organization is doing. We need more people, more people who are willing to make good trouble, to stand up for what is just, for what is right and for what is good. And you are doing just that. I know at times when you go against the grain, let me say that one more time. I know at times when you go against the grain, because I'm experiencing that right now, that the heaviness that you feel, and sometimes it can feel lonely because you're standing up doing the right thing. I do want you to know, and I don't want you to get weary and well-doing, and I do want you to know the work that you are doing all across this country is greatly appreciated because you are doing everything that you can as an organization to strengthen the Democratic Party, to make it better so that it can truly be in service to the people of this great nation. We have a two-party system, and we need one of the parties I wish it could be both of them, but we need at least one of the parties to stand up and do what's right by the people. You hear all kinds of sound effects right now because I am outside. As I said, I am canvassing and this is happening in real time. Thank you, Lawrence, and to all the other leaders in this great organization. I appreciate you so very much. And hopefully when this primary is over, we can come together. So everybody take care of yourself. Please stay strong. Keep the faith and keep the fight. And let me close with one of my favorite quotes. I am a quote machine, as you all know. And one of my favorites is coming from Congresswoman Barbara Jordan. What the people want is very simple. They want an America as good as it's promised. In your own way, in my own way, and other people who are conscious-minded, we are doing just that in our spaces and in our places. We are adding to, working towards, creating an America as good as it's promised. You take good care. Until next time.